Hello guys, welcome back to another Fishing Planet video. This is an update video. I already uh, did this video two years ago, but it's a very old and I wanted to update a little bit with webcam. That's why I do it again. This is a Lone Star Invisible Line. It's a fish monster. Uh, you need to catch the Mad Eye Buffalo, but before you can catch it, you need the Invisible Line. And how do you get the Invisible Line? You catch it, yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, catch it in the water, and you need to put it in your backpack, five pieces. I already got four. So where are we going? We are going to spawn over here, private room. All right, so we spawn over here. This is what I'm using, what you see. It's, uh, a what I'm using is a jig winner, but you can use whatever um, rod you own. Casting rod, spinning rod. So I use the Jig Winner 217, that's 6 kilograms. With the Bremer 4500, 5.9. I got 6 kilograms braid on it, 0 0.15, and I use a simple casting spoon, 7 gram 10. So that's what I'm using. We spawn here, now we run over the bridge. Be careful that you don't fall in. Alright, here we are. We turn to the left. And this is the area where I want to stand. And I'm going to throw in over here. Because this, this is wheat. There we go. I put my rod down. And slowly I reel in. And then we hope, yes, we hope that we get stuck. And that we get it. There we go. First throw, I already get the backlash with wheat. We keep it, so we will have five. There we go. Lone Star Invisible Line. Reward, invisible line, the item is in my backpack, so let's claim it, mission accomplished, great work, you got invisible line and now ready to hunt for the mad eye buffalo, alright, we claim it, now we go back to missions, and now we're gonna check where it is, mad eye buffalo, there he is, now that you've got some invisible line, try to catch the legendary Mad Eye Buffalo. It might take you quite a few tries to reel in the heavyweight 5 kg Mad Eye Buffalo without breaking the old and frail line. The monster lives around the middle of the lake and eats mostly in the early morning, evening, or in the middle of the day, depending on the weather. Alright. So, you know what? Let's track the mission. And let's go to the middle of the lake. That means we want to spawn over here. This is home sweet home. That's the first thing we're going to do. And of course we need to put invisible line on a float setup. This is my setup that I'm using. Omni float 450, that's 3.5 kilograms. On there I got the Callisto MG2500, that's also 3.5 kilograms. I use an oval hook 4 with dough balls and we need to put on the invisible line we only got 75 meters so it's not uh, a shitload of uh, line 75 meters is not much so let's hope we will catch him the first time we hook him uh, on the right side you see this, this setup in imperial for my imperial friends it was the same story when i told you about this on the right side you saw the imperial all right, let's go fishing over here. We want to fish over here. And we want to check the time because you catch him in the morning, evening, or I guess that we are going to catch him on this day, maybe in this peak. So I'm going to try. I'm going to put it up to this peak. I'm going to forward the time. I got my death, as you uh, saw, on 102 centimeters on the right side, Imperial again. So guys, I'm gonna try to catch him, and I'm back with you as soon as I got him. Alright, we got a ping. Do we got the monster over here? I hope so. So let's see, guys. Are we go to hook the monster? I think we hooked... Mm, squad a fighter. I think we hooked the monster. 
At least, I hope. Oh my god, he's coming all the way over here. I don't think he will come in that easy. I can't believe. Let's follow him. Probably this is the monster, guys. Uh, I'm gonna make sure that I cut some time. Because I don't think you want to see the entire fight. Uh, very important, guys. Uh, your reel, put it one dot back. Like I have. Don't max drag. Because at the moment that I'm recording this video, you can max drag. But when we get uh, the update in this game, you cannot max drag anymore. So make sure you put your reel back one. So I'm going to speed up and I'm back with you guys when I got him. Alright, he is getting closer guys. Uh, what I found out, a very important thing. Keep following the fish. When the fish swims to the right, walk after him. If he goes to the other side, follow him. And there we are. We got him. Let's look at this beautiful fish. This is nice guys. This is a nice fish. Let's see, how do we do that? Like this. Mad-Eye Buffalo, 5.866 kilograms, 77.3 centimeters. That is a very, very nice fish. It gives you some nice XP. Like I said, make sure you put your reel one down, not max drag. Because max drag, it's not possible in the future. So guys, I hope this video will really help you to catch him. We are going to keep this one, and then it's time to talk about what time did I catch him. Okay, we claim that. Thank you very much. And we claim also this. Thank you very much. What time did I catch him? I catch him on a sunny day. Uh, I started fishing at 1, and now it's 1.46, so uh, 45 minutes in game time. So I started at 1 on, on a sunny day. We also gonna put a marker on this fish. Yes, of course. So there we go, Mad Eye Buffalo. This is the marker 21.71 at 9.80. If you guys have no idea how to put a marker, uh, on a computer I know it's with uh, M. So then you go to this map. Then you place this. If he asks you, do you want to put it on the last fish, you say, uh, no. Then you zoom in. And then you find these coordinates that I showed you, but then on the fish. And then you say, you want to put, yes, and then you put a marker there. So I'm going to remove this one. So for people who don't know how to put a marker, and of course, after you catch the fish, you can just put a marker the same way. Alright, guys, I hope this video will help you. This is an update video. I already had a video about this monster, but this is an update. A little bit uh, more about the weather and uh, a marker and that kind of stuff. And like I said, keep following the fish. If it goes over there, walk over there. If it goes over there, walk over there, follow the fish. So guys, enjoy catching this beautiful monster fish. And if you like the video and it helps you, please subscribe to my channel. Thumbs up. It's all for free and very important for a little channel like me. And see you in the next video, guys. Tight lines.